Moving down the list of fixtures that we have down here, the one kind of oddball is this, uh, or is it Quinta FX? Um, so some of it works, some of it doesn't. I don't know how much of, like some of it's really bright and ostentatious. I think only the one nearest us really works. So I programmed a button here that has a macro similar to the one that you guys were using pretty regularly. So if you click on this one here, you'll see it comes on and it starts just throwing the confetti out and things like that. It seems like it's got a couple of uh, couple of lights that are that may be out on it. The other one doesn't seem to come on as much. I noticed that if we used these auto programs, we can get the other one to do stuff, but it doesn't do the same stuff. So like the laser seems to work. The um, there's these really the blinders definitely work on both of them. I don't know how often you plan on using those. But like I said, if you want to, and I'll go over it one more time, if you want to make one of these a button, we will just select something that we like these lights to do. Like here's, I guess, the one that had the blinders coming out. So once we've selected something, we'll just call this one Macro 2, I guess. And then we'll go up to New Scene under Button. So go to New Scene here. And then we'll come over to the keyboard and type in Macro and macro 2 you can see as you see now so then we'll come down here and hit OK and now you have macro 2 and you have macro 3 and again to make that light stop doing what it's doing just click initiate and it'll turn off